In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to create a cool picture film strip effect in Photoshop, which can be a fun way to present your photos. Click File, then New. Create an image with a width of 4000 pixels and a height of 1000 pixels. Click OK. Create a new layer by clicking in the New Layer icon in the Layers panel. Click on the Rectangle tool and at the top click the Custom Shape tool option. Click on the drop-down arrow attached to the shape box and click on the expansion arrow on the right. In the menu that appears, click Film and then click OK. From the new selection of shapes, select the one that has multiple spaces for photos. Drag it onto your canvas. Use the mouse tool if you need to centralize the shape. Now click Image, Image Rotation and 90 degrees clockwise. Now we are going to add our pictures to the film strip. You should already have these photos open in Photoshop. If you are inserting photographs, you should probably make them smaller to fit the photo strip image. Here we are clicking Image, then Image Size, and reducing the width to 500 pixels. Repeat this process for all the photos that you want to insert. Navigate to the image you want to place first, and press Ctrl A on the keyboard, then Ctrl and C. Navigate back to the photo strip image and press Ctrl and V and the image will be inserted as a new layer. Now, in the Layers panel, click on the layer that contains the film strip image and resize it so the first frame matches the photo we just inserted. A little bit of overlap is just fine. Hit Return to apply the transformation. Go through this copy and paste process again with all the other photos and place them into the frames. Now click the layer with the film strip shape in it, here layer 1, and drag it to the top of the layers panel above all the other layers and this will place it over them all. Click layer, then flatten image. Select the rectangular marquee tool and draw a selection around the film strip. Click image, then crop, and that is how to create a picture film strip in Photoshop.